Things look quiet enough here. Come on, there's my uncle. What's up, everybody? <coughs> Back in the adventures as well. Skyrim. Had. What are you doing? Are you, are you on the beach? From the home. So, bones. What happened to you, boy? Are you Uncle, please keep your voice down. I'm fine, but we should go inside to talk. What's going on? And who's this? He's a friend. Saved my life, in fact. Come on, I'll explain everything, but we need to go inside. Ain't every day we get visitors in Riverwood. Of course. Take what you need. But what's all this about? What are you two doing here? What? A dragon? <coughs> that explains what I saw earlier. Flying down the valley from the south. I was hoping I was wrong about what I thought it was. A dragon. Here in Skyrim. What's this world coming to? First the war, now dragons. Trouble loves company, they say. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. <clears throat> Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgraf in Whiterun to send whatever soldiers he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. I see no harm in it, if you have the skill. The grindstone will improve your weapons. Use the table to improve your armor. If you've got the raw materials, you can use the forge to make something new. All right. <clears throat> Let's see. A dragon! I saw a dragon! What? What is it now, Mother? It was as big as a mountain. Last night, it flew right over the barrel. Dragons now, is it? Please, Mother. If you keep on like this, the one in town... <coughs> oh, excuse me. And I've got better things to do than listen to more of your friends. It was a dragon. It'll kill us all, and then you'll believe me. Um, nothing yet. Oh, I do need it. Okay. Sigrid, we have company. Hadvar, we've been so worried about you. Come, you two must be hungry. Sit down and I'll get you something to eat. Now then, boy. Helgen was destroyed? How did you get away? I don't know where to stop. You know I was assigned to General Tully as a scout. We were stopped in Helgen when we were attacked by a dragon. When your friend told me, I didn't believe it at first either. Mara's mercy. A dragon? In Helgen? Why, you could be here at any moment. I'm sure Riverwood will be all right, dear. When the Yara learns what's happened, he's sure to send soldiers. Go on, Hadvar. Let's hear the rest of it. 
Not much more to tell. This dragon flew over and just wrecked the whole place. Mass confusion. I don't know if anyone else got out alive. I doubt I'd made it out myself if not for my friend here. I need to get back to Solitude and let them know what's happened. I thought you could help us out. Food, supplies, a place to stay. Of course. Any friend of Hadvar's is a friend of mine. I'm glad to help however I can. Take what you need, my friend. Within reason, of course. Cross the river and then head north. You'll see it just past the falls. Talking when you to get to White Run, <laughs> just keep going up. When you get to the top of the hill, you're at Dragon's Reach. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Hadfar, did you really see a dragon? What did it look like? Did it have big teeth? Hush, well, child. Don't I'd pester your cousin. Work. You two make yourselves at home. <clears throat> That's a decent weapon you've made there. Head north, okay? <clears throat> A shield. I guess not. It's okay. Along the river, huh? A bunny rabbit. Heard it. Right there. It's got to be it right there. Got here quick. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, what's this? That's taken off. care of. No thanks to you. Certainly not. But a true warrior would have relished the opportunity to take on a giant. That's why I'm here with my shield brothers. An outsider, eh? Never heard of the companions? An order of warriors. We are brothers and sisters in honor. And we show up to solve problems if the coin is good enough. I'll take my leave then. You look strong. Come to your basker and be a companion. Well, that's taken care of. No thanks to you. All right, I'll see you later. tired of hanging around <laughs> talking all day. We've got the fleetest fleet in all the Skyrim. This is the way in. Okay. I found it.
Halt. City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. Fine. But we'll be keeping an eye on you. Takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. I just can't fill an order. Be careful. Arnold? away before someone gets hurt. My lord, please. What would you have, to, have do to listen? Nothing? My lord. What's the please. meaning of this interruption? Jarl no Baldrath is not receiving I just need visitors. More we act. I just Well, that explains Who's why the guards let you in. Come on then. The Jarl will want to speak to you personally. So, you were at Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes? By Ismir, Irileth was right. What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If that the dragon is lurking in the mountains... That is a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should <laughs> Enough. not... I'll not stand idly by while the dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Irileth, send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my yard. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. All this standing the around is rubbish. We should be taken well to fight the storm clothes. You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done White Run a service, and I won't forget it. Here, take this as a small token of my esteem. There is another thing you could do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents, perhaps. Come, let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors of dragons. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostilities, like the rest of the great warriors? So, you wish to master the arcane arts? Okay.
Hmm? What? Project? You think you could help me? I really don't think so. The Jarl can be found in the Great Hall, probably sitting on his Jarl's throne. Not over here in a wizard's Barangar. laboratory. I think I found someone who can help you with your dragon project. Go ahead and fill him in with all the details. So the Jarl thinks you can be of use to me. Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. <laughs> nice. Ah, no mere brute mercenary but a thinker. Perhaps even a scholar? You see, when the stories of dragons began to circulate, many dismissed them as mere fantasies, rumors, impossibilities. One sure mark of a fool is to dismiss anything that falls outside his experience as being impossible. But I began to search for information about dragons. Where had they gone all those years ago? And where were they coming from? I, uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow. A dragon stone said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. An old tomb built by the ancient Nords, perhaps dating back to the Dragon War itself. Ah, maybe you just want to know how to get there. It's near Riverwood, a miserable little village a few miles south of here. I'm sure some of the locals can point you in the right direction once you get there. Well, you must preserve some professional secrets, mustn't we? I have my sources. Reliable sources. Sadly, no. My work affords me few opportunities for such an adventure. Perhaps some hero will bring one to Dragon's Reach, like old Olaf one I once did. What a fascinating conversation that would be. Off to Bleak Falls Barrow with you. The Jarl is not a patient man. Neither am I, come to think of it. We need it quickly, before it's too late. Of course, Jarl Valgroof. You seem to have found me an able assistant. I'm sure you